Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back. My name is Candy and this is Stuff and Budget. It's game time, so let's just go ahead and get right into it. You guys, I had to just pop this in here really quick because you guys know how I'm always so forgetful on what day it is because I don't film on that day. So I'm like going to be editing my game time video for Thursday, April 11th. And that is my sister's birthday, you guys. And I completely forgot to mention it in the video. So my sister, Karen, she's over at The Faithful Dash. I know a lot of you follow her as well. But today is her birthday. So go ahead and go over to her channel and, you know, wish her a happy birthday and all of that good stuff. So Karen, happy birthday. I totally forgot. You know me. I forget what day it is. Forget what day I'm filming. I really need to have a calendar handy. I always say that, but I'm going to this time. So happy birthday. I hope you enjoy your day and I will talk to you soon. Okay, so let's get back into the video. So I only have a few pieces of Happy Mail. So I'm just going to go ahead and open those up. If you guys want to skip this little part of it, it shouldn't be too long, but I'll put the timestamp right here for you guys that want to skip this part. But first off, I have something from Terry. She's from Saving with a Senior and she sent me a little card. And I'm not going to read the card on camera. I don't know if you guys like me to or not. I just don't, just in case there's something personal in there. Because I don't look at it until I open it. But it looks like she sent me... How cute are these, you guys? They're little minis. And they are super cute. So we've got a color roll and save. This one is, you know, you can choose your own amounts. And then this one is all $3. So these are super cute, perfect for my minis. And then she also sent me some stickers. These are super cute. And I have my stickers piling up. I do need to put them in my sticker book. But yeah, so thank you so much, Terry. These are so cute. Terry is one of my members and she is just super sweet, you guys. So she sent me that in this nice little card here and I will read the card off camera. But thank you so much, Terry. That was so sweet of you. I swear I can't get enough about like people sending me things on their own like that is just super sweet and then this is from Kimmy from Bayesian Girl Budgets I am part of her membership so I think this is for her members let me check this out this is so cute you guys she loves panda bears so that is super cute you could totally make this into a challenge and like put an amount for each letter and then color it in Oh my gosh, you guys, it's like a personalized challenge. Kimmy, this is freaking so cute. And it's a color and save. So color and save however much you want for each letter. Good thing my name is short. <laughs> and then there's a bunch of scratchers here. This is so stinking cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute, Kimmy. I love this so much. Oh my gosh, okay. And then a little dashboard. I guess this could be a dashboard for that. I love that, that is so creative. Okay, so there's that. And I think I might've shown her address, so I need to block that out. Okay, and this is from Liz and Les. I swear, you guys, every Happy Mail video I do is probably gonna have something from Liz because I just love her channel so much. Or I mean, I love her channel and I love her um, challenges. Like, I'm obsessed. Okay, so these are a couple of her new ones. This is a Daddy Long Legs. This is a limited release, so I had to grab it, and it came with a little sticker. This one is so stinking cute. I love this one so much. And then this is totally my jam. Her and Ren came up with some toast challenges because Tracy over Golden Girl, Golden Girl Budgets loves toast, and so they did this. But you guys, look at all the different jams, and then the peanut butter. I love that so much. And then this is a Zen. This is now and Zen. And it's a bunch of little Zen rocks. And she kind of shows you how you could, you know, stack them up. And then you just save the amounts as you stack them up. And you do that on this side. And then we've got this beach one. Oh, it goes this way. Here's the towels and then the umbrellas. And then you guys look at how cute that is. It is called Stay Salty, and she gives you a guideline as to where to lay like the towel and the umbrellas, but this is so stinking cute. All right, so that is my happy mail, and I am going to be using them, Liz. I'm not going to hoard them too much. 
but you know, I can't play as much as I'm buying. So, all right, so let's go ahead. Oops, I always do that. Let's go ahead and count this money out and see how much we have today. We have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we have 175 to play with today. And let's just go ahead and start with the binder that I always start with. This is from Busy Lizzie Budgets. This is Let's Get Personal. And we have two more to play. And then we will unstuff this and have it as one challenge. So if you've ever found money on the ground, not coins, add this, if not add that. And yes, I actually have. I've found um you know like five dollars ten dollars i don't think i found like that much money but uh, but yes i have found bills before on the floor not just coins two dollars that's awesome so let me know in the comments you guys how much was the most you've ever found on the ground not in coins like i found I guess it doesn't count because it says if you found money on the ground. I've found a wallet before that had like a hundred and something dollars in it, but I, I got the ID out and then I actually mailed the lady a letter saying that I found her wallet because there was no phone number. And so she, I know I gave her my information and she called me and I went and I met her and I gave it back, but I just know how important like, you know, our wallet and our phone and our, just our personal things are. And so I'm glad I found it and not somebody that just, would have kept it so okay next one is if you've ever had the chicken pox yes i have so we are going to go ahead and scratch this one Ooh, we're paying the toll for chicken pox <laughs> and you know what let me put this two dollars back in here because we're not um can we know it's not a combined question so this two dollars goes in here and then we will get nine dollars for our Yes, we had the chicken pox. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I was pretty young. I think I was like in first or second grade, if I can remember correctly, or, or maybe not that young. I think I was like more like fourth or fifth grade because I think I wanted to go to Disneyland with one of my friends and I couldn't go because I had the chicken pox. And I didn't have them too bad. Like I just remember them, but I it wasn't like really crazy where I have like any sort of you know, significant scar from any of them. So, um, so yeah, so let me, let me guys, I think I said that in my last video. <laughs> let me know if you guys had the chicken pox. All right, so that is it for the binder, you guys. We made it all the way through on one side. So I will unstuff this maybe in a separate video. I'm not sure when, and then we will get going on the flip side. Okay, so that is that. This one is our Oops Year Round Mystery Savings Challenge, and this is from Budgeting by Dina US. I always forget to say who, who this one is from, but it's by Budgeting by Dina US, and she has a lot of different uh, versions now of this, and so you guys should go check out her shop. All right, Dina. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and do, we are in April, so let's go ahead and scratch this one and see what we got. Okay, you guys, it's a two, so not bad. Let's go ahead and add $2 into here. And let's see, $2, one, two, or should I just scratch off another one? Because that's not bad, right? Let's see, let's just do one. Oh man, I shouldn't have done that, but I guess that's what I get. <laughs> All right, you guys, $9. Let's put $1 back and get a 10. And we only have one more for April now to do. And I think we have two more game times after this, so that's okay. I'll just finish this one up a little bit early. Ah. Okay, there's that one. Let's go ahead and get into our careers mashup. All right, so uh, let me get my dice here. Just put it right there. All right, so here's black for the bottom, and then let's roll this blingy pink for the top. Okay, so one for the top, two for the bottom. So we've got one for the top, which is our astronaut, and then two for the bottom, which is our fireman. So we've got an astronaut fire, fire firefighter, <laughs> and let's see what we're gonna color in today. 
All right, let me get a marker. So let's go ahead and do, hmm, so we've got, I don't want to do that much in here today. So let's do a, let's do a two and a seven. So we'll do $9 today, you guys. So two and a seven. Yay. So $9. Let's see how much we have all together. This is Save with Sydney Bear. And you guys, if I forget to mention names of any of the stuff I'm playing, it is in the description. So let's take a dollar out and get a 10. Now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, wait, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 25, 35, 36, 37, 137. Should I get grab some money out of here? Let's see, what do I have? Two fives? Let's get two fives and trade that for a 10 and then trade two tens for a 20. There we go. All right. Let's put that in here now. This is so cute. All right, I have many more to play after I finish that one. <laughs> Let's get into our binder. All right. So someone had told me I should put this envelope that I'm always going to play in front of where I left off. And I think that is a great idea because I always start this. Let's just do that right now because my brain would probably just skip it even though I'm talking about it anyways. So let's put this here. That way, when I'm finished with this, we go on to where we should be going. Right? All right. Let's put this over here. And let's just get out everything, oops, everything from here. Okay, so first up is our, it's going to be May. This is from Liz at Liz and Less. Today is Thursday, so, ah, what is the date, you guys? Let me see. The date today is, <laughs> well, today is not Thursday, it's the 7th. So today is Sunday. So Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So we are gonna need to collect two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14 dollars, you guys. 14 dollars. And let's see, what should I do? I'll put a five, I'll put six back and get a 20. Okay? If that makes sense. Okay. Perfect. So that is it. This is super cute. Let me know if you guys are playing this one from Liz. It's a free, she had this as a freebie on her channel. And I just think it's super cute. All right, next up is our group play. This is from Ellie on Earth. Super cute. Let's see what we've got today. And we've got a nine. So I was thinking we would scratch off the rest, but no, we won't. All right, $9, you guys. So let's go ahead and get the five. Six, seven, eight, and nine. Uh oh, we only have one dollar, so I hope we are not going to need that right now. But so for Ellie, we have 20, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 44 dollars, and that is super fun. So we'll put this one behind Liz's challenge. Let me just move my little plant out of the way. I like to have it there, but then it just, I guess, it just gets in the way. There we go. Okay. So next up is our April. This is from D Plans and Budgets. And we already colored in the A. So let's go ahead and color in the P. And we're not going to do two letters this time. Because for April, we're going to need to color in two. So we are just going to do a five. So five and ten. Super cute. All right, now where we left off was right here. This is from Tewa2. Let me move this over. This is Camp Quit Your Bitchin'. Super cute. Let's go ahead and scratch a couple off. So I am going to just scratch two because I want to do that. So let's do this one and this one. All right, so $7. That is not bad. Let me see if I have any ones in here. I do. So... Let's go ahead and trade out five ones for five. OK, 
Okay, and then now we will get our $7. So here is five, six, and seven. So now total we have 20, 40, 50, 55, 65, 70, 5, 80, 1, and 2. $82, you guys. That is awesome. I love seeing like little bits add up. All right, so next up is Roland with Manomi's. Let's see. Okay, so here we go. Let's go ahead and where are we? We are here. So let's go ahead and roll my dice. I guess I could have just left this here. Six. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, and then we landed here six so each dash is worth two dollars so we've got two four six eight ten okay let's scratch off this scratcher and see what we got okay we got a six so here's five and six and then here it says grab twinkles and get rolling save six dollars so let's grab another six dollars so i'm gonna trade um these two fives and the ten for a twenty and then let's see how much we got now i went ahead and condensed this a little bit because i needed some change that's why i have the hundred dollars in here but let's see now, we have 120, 40, 60, 80, 1, 2, 3. $183. That is awesome, you guys. I don't know what the total is for this, but that is so cool. I guess it depends on how you play it, because maybe some people would play that a little bit differently. I don't know. Okay, on to Georgette. We are here. So let's go ahead and we're going to scratch two off. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. You guys, I'm going to just scratch off another one because that's $3. Um, should I scratch another one? That's five, six. Okay, you guys, I couldn't help myself. I just had to do all of them because they're so small. So we've got three, six, seven, eight, nine dollars, nine dollars, and we finished this challenge. So I'm gonna put one dollar back and grab a ten. And this was super a super low amount of a challenge. So we've got ten, fifteen, sixteen dollars, and that is for Georgette. Let me grab a little paper. I should be a little more prepared, but I'm not. <laughs> okay, so let me just. Okay, you guys, so we've got, this is egg basket. Egg basket. And this is Georgette. And it is $16. Woohoo, okay. Let me bring this out. Yay! Okay. We finished a challenge, guys. Unexpectedly. That's the best kind, right? All right. So there's that. And we'll put that right there. Perfect. All right. So now we get to start at the beginning. We are on Ma, Ma, Ma. <laughs> this is from Budget with Carly. And I hear this million, a million times a day, you guys. All right, so we've got a six, and let's do one more. Okay, six and a seven is 13. So we shall get $13 out. Um, oops, one, two, three, and a 10. And I'm out of ones, so I hope I don't need ones. So we've got 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, $19 in our mom. Ma challenge from Budget with Carly. Okay, and then now we are on to RVHS stack. This is so cute, you guys. And we are doing one movie per scratch. So why don't we go ahead and do Pretty Woman? See what she's got for us. 
Okay, you guys, it's a five and a nine, so $14. Let me grab a one out of here, and then I'll put in 15. Okay, so we've got $25 all together now in our VH stack of savings. This is super cute. It's from Spooky Budgets. Okay. All right, so today is Thursday, you guys. How are you guys doing? How has your week been? Let me know if you guys have anything fun coming up this weekend. I think I ask like the same questions all the time, but you know what? There's a lot of questions in this video, right? Because I do the let's get personal and I ask you those questions and then what you guys have been doing or what's coming up for you guys. So feel free to just comment whatever you want. <laughs> all right, um, this is our grease challenge. And it says, my heart is stuck on you. Um, oh, my heart is set on you. $150 scratch off savings. This is by, oh man. Oh, here it is. Budgets a bloom. Thank you for putting that there. Okay, let's see what this one is. Okay, you guys, it's a $5. I think I'm getting lucky because for a $150 challenge, I'm thinking those should be a little higher, but we got a five last time and we got a five today and I am fine with that. So I'm actually gonna take the five I have and I'm gonna put $10. Yay, now we get to play a little bit more, I feel like. All right, next up, I just love this one so much, you guys. This is from Champagne's Corner. It's Ariel and Ursula in their little Vogue cover shoot. And let's go ahead and scratch this one. Okay, $2. Let's see if I'm gonna need to scratch another one. And I think I am because I don't have $2. Okay, let's scratch another one. Let's do this one down here. Okay, seven. So seven plus two is nine. I'm gonna put a dollar back and grab a 10. So that works. We have 10, 15, $21. This is so cute. I love this one. All right, I'm thinking those next two are gonna be high ones because it's a save $50 challenge. All right, on to Lindsay over at Boy Mom Loves to Save. I wish I was a little bit taller. Let's see if we can scratch these two off today. No, <laughs> it's a $10, you guys. Or I mean, should we? And then we'll just finish it off. Why not? You know what? Why not? Let's live on the edge today. Let's be crazy. You guys, I am a freaking rebel because we got a 10 and a 10, <laughs> so $20. But you know what? We finished the challenge. That is awesome. I still need to do my randomizer video for all the challenges I finished in March. I just need to get it together. I've been so busy with other things that I have just been like trying to get everything else settled so hopefully we'll have that done soon so anyways here is 50 70 80 95 100 dollars you guys 100 dollars i wish i was a little bit taller i wish i was a baller yay okie dokie there's two down awesome all right really quick i had dropped some things in my etsy shop and i'm gonna do a little giveaway so the first one is going to be if you guys like the movie the notebook this is inspired by that movie it is so stinking cute i love these so much this one is it wasn't over it still isn't over <laughs> you guys remember that part Ugh, i just love it so it has um the little scenery in the background with a dock. I put a little dock and then it's raining. Super cute. I love this. And then this one says, if you're a bird, I'm a bird. And you guys, oh, I just love this movie. And okay, so this one is a save 45. This one is a save 60. These are actually in my shop now, but I'm going to give a set away. So if you guys want this, um, just go ahead and put hashtag notebook in the comments, all lowercase notebook n-o-t-e-b-o-o-k -O -O all one word and i'm going to choose a winner this will close on you guys are watching this on thursday so it'll, it'll be a quick giveaway it'll close on tuesday at 8 p.m so tuesday at 8 p.m i'm going to pick a winner for hashtag the notebook 
Then I'm also going to be giving away, I don't think I showed this one, but I have this one in my shop. It is the, do you know how fast you were going speeding one? And I did a 2.0 version because I feel like I got a lot of movement on this one. So I did another version. This is a 2.0. The denominations are a little bit different or the amounts are a little bit different of what you pay. So the original was two, three, five, and then a $10 for the 100 mile per hour. This one is a three, four, five. And then I did move, I did change the numbers and I did move the 100 mile per hour one to somewhere else. So it's different. It looks the same, but it's different. And I'm going to give a set of these away as well. So you can put hashtag speeding for this one. And then one more giveaway in this video. You guys should stay tuned because I'm going to sprinkle some giveaway stuff in all of my videos coming up or not all of my videos, but you know, a few of them coming up. This is my ice cream. I forgot what I called it, but um, this one is a chill out, save $40. This one is a mystery challenge and these are just super cute. So if you want this set, it's going to be hashtag ice cream, all one word, all lowercase. Okay, so we got hashtag notebook, hashtag speeding, and then hashtag ice cream. And again, that will close next, what did I say? <laughs> I forgot. Tuesday. Tuesday at 8 p.m. Okay, let's get into more challenges here. We are on to Ren's cards. This one says ruffle some feathers. So this is Mischief Managed Budgets, Mischief Budget over on Etsy. And let's go ahead and scratch this off. Okay, three, you guys, three. And I don't have $3. Let's see if I have any ones back here. And I do. So I'm gonna put two back and grab a five. What's next? What's coming up? What is coming up? Okay. So let's go ahead and stop there. So now all together for, and this is a pretty low one. I, I felt like I was getting high ones for a while. So I've got 20, 40, 65, $75, $75. I love these little cards and I'm so happy that I'm actually using using them and not hoarding them. <laughs> All right, next up is our Enchanted Forest. I don't even know if it's called Enchanted Forest, but I just think it's an Enchanted Forest and I love it. This is from Misfits of Budgeting. Let's go ahead and scratch this guy. Okay, $3. We've got that one, two, three. And I want to finish Janelle's challenge. So let's go ahead and just stop here for this one. Uh, let's, should we condense this? One, two, three, four, five. We'll grab a five. And okay. So we've got 20, 40, 5, 55, 61, 2, 62 dollars. And it could be 70 or plus depending on, I guess, depending on if you scratch the two times, it depends which one you times by two. So there's that. Okay, so for Janelle's challenge, we had one more to scratch and we are gonna finish that one today, guys. So let's go ahead and see what. Yes, you guys, $3, woohoo. Okay, let's put $2 in here and get a five just in case. So now all together, it should be $75. So 20, 30, 5, 40, 5, 50, 5, 65, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is 70. Five. <laughs> all right. Don't mind me over here just kind of being a weirdo laughing at myself. Okay. Woohoo! Yay! Okay, three challenges down today, you guys. That is awesome. All right, next up. This is my Wizard of Oz challenge. And it's so funny because I was looking all over for this one because this is the, the first one that I have done. But this is also up in my shop and I was going to give this one away too. So you know what? I am. So in including uh, the other stuff for my giveaway, if you guys want to win this one, it's going to be hashtag wizard. Hashtag wizard, all lowercase. So let's go ahead and start scratching. So here is the little guide. If you get a ruby, it's $3. An emerald is five. And if you scratch off the diamond, it's 10. So I hope I don't have an IOU. 
And you guys, I'm nuts because yes, I make these challenges, but yes, I forget where I put everything. <laughs> so let's go ahead and just do up here. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay, three dollars. One, two, and three. Yay! So we get to play another game. And I'm peeping Liz's challenge back there. Okay, so $3 for our Wizard of Oz. I just love this one. And you know what? I have more coming of this collection because I did purchase a set of Wizard of Oz images. So it's just a matter of me having the time to create a challenge. So I am, there's more to come. So stay tuned for that. And I'm super excited about it because I think I'm going to make some minis as, as well. Of course, right? Because Mini Mondays. We all love Mini Mondays. Eek! I'm so excited for this one, you guys. This is Homebody, Homebody Living Room by Liz. And it says, start with the rug. And the rug is $10. So I don't have $10. I have five. So we're going to have a $5 IOU because we got to start with the rug. Okay. So here we go. Here's the rug. And I don't even, re I remember watching her video on how to set it up, but you know what? Let's just, do, let's just figure this out together. <laughs> There's the rug. So we've got $10 for our rug. Here is five. And I have an IOU for $5. And that is okay. Yay. Okay. I love, I love Liz's challenges. Okay, there's that. Here's our IOU. Let's stick that in there with a pom-pom. And our next challenge that we're going to start with is going to be the doggy, or the doggy, <laughs> is going to be blackjack, you guys. So fun. This is going to be a new one as well in the binder. And so let's go ahead. Oh, look it. We almost made it all the way through. Let's go ahead and grab this and move it like... I forgot who said it, but I'm, it wasn't my idea. Someone told me to do it, and so I'm doing it. All right. If it was you, let me know in the comments, because this is a super good idea for me, because my brain just doesn't work sometimes. Okay. Perfect. Yay. All right. So maybe I should... Hmm. Let me put the doggy here. That way I know we're going to start here and then we have the IOU and then we will start with the blackjack. So I will remember that, hopefully. <laughs> no promises, you guys. Okay, so that is it for game time. I always feel like I'm missing something, but I hope I didn't. Again, thank you guys so much for always coming back and watching. Yes, I did forget this. We need to do our ding, ding, ding. And I just had my envelope. Here it is. So we need three dollars. Three dollars. And we've got it right here. Three dollars. Magic. Let's go ahead and put that in here. And should I count it so far, you guys? I don't think I've counted it in a while. So let's do it. We've got 20, 40, 20, 40, 20, 30, 40, 5, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. 51 challenges complete since the beginning of the year. That is awesome. All right, so let's put that away. And we are going to put this in my little drawer in a minute. But yeah, thank you guys again so much for watching. I appreciate all of you guys always coming back and just showing me a bunch of support. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And I hope you guys have an awesome weekend coming up. Happy Thursday or whenever you're watching this. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.